taking to the floor for the first women's cycle ball final. It's Japan versus Germany. Now an opportunity with the Japan player who put their foot down. It's two versus one. Chance to move the ball for shooting chance. Great save by the Japan goalkeeper. The ball is in the goal area. Japan trying to get it oh. clear. Can't have two defenders in the area. The ball is by the goal and it didn't quite cross the line. Sheer amazing and defense from Japan there. Japan holds on. What amazing persistence from the goalkeeper there. It's nothing so far and now oh. Germany. They played the ball high, they went directly for the shot, and it was the low corner that created the opportunity for the player in the middle to take it around the goalkeeper's movement. Kick off for Japan in this second half. Germany, though, take control. Now they've got a decent shooting chance. The German player trying to block the Japan defender, and that gives her teammate the space to find the bottom corner. So the second goal of the match. And she blocks the shot. Shot and a good save. Germans playing cautiously. The goalkeeper went back to the goal to cover once that free shot was taken. Now they've got another shooting chance and it goes just wide. Find an angle for a shot. Goes around the defender. Covers the ball back in. High shot oh. off the crossbar. Another chance. The Japan goalkeeper stayed in play. Both defenders can't go in the D. Otherwise, oh. it will be a four meter penalty. Great and shot and another save, penalty save, and also manages to recover the rebound. So again, once more, excellent, excellent play. Great corner routine though, and these moves that can be practiced and rehearsed, clinical, that was uh, beautifully executed. The pass back creates a great angle for the shot. One last chance for Japan. The ball's loose in front of the goal, but the time just runs out on them, and Germany are the world champions. So what an amazing first World Championships final. The play absolutely to the wire. This is the match for the bronze medal. And uh, we have the uh, two teams in front of us. This is Austria versus Czechia. Oh. Toying with oh! the goalkeeper. Toying with the goalkeeper. This time it's dispatched, yes. That's so, uh, it, isn't it? Classic move. In the final minute and a half now of this oh, first half. And nice a ball. long shot from Austria, making the back of the net. As the team starts chasing the game, it's very hard to, to get it back. It can snowball out of control. A little nice move there and a brilliant goal. Now the Austrian team are four up at half time. And so an instant and goal. Instantly, first five seconds of the second half, uh, Austria take the opportunity to score again. First goal for Czechia against uh, Austria today, so 5-1 now. And into the top corner of the goal. And another quick play, and that pass is so incisive if you can reach the corner and cut it back across. Some cracking saves. He's uh, had to work very hard. A good chance for his teammate here. Excellent work on the counter-attack. Ball again, but this time it breaks for Austria. And, and their turn. up into the top of the net. 8-3 at the moment. This is the playoff for the bronze medal. Now a, a chance for a quick check your move if they can find the space. And yeah, they do. Now 2v1, another chance for Czechia, and yes. they add another to the scoreline. 8-5 for the bronze medal position, and uh, third place in the competition going to Austria. The crowd are ready. Are you ready? I think I'm ready, Jesse. Well, yes, I think so. the question is, is Germany and Switzerland ready? Give their teams the, the push they need to put on a show. So one and a half minutes already gone on this first half as the first goal is scored and it is Switzerland who put a marker down early. Absolutely fantastic games to make the final. Germany here as well oh. as we see an equaliser from Germany. Here we go, corner opportunity. You'll see the potentially a hand signal. They go high, and great save. So Andre could bring the ball out here. Makes the pass, and it's a goal for Germany. They take the lead. Here we go. We are in the second half. Germany two, Switzerland one. It is all to play for. And get themselves close to that rainbow jersey. So it's a great shot. Backhand save from the goalkeeper. Oh, wonderful from Andre Kopp. Oh, 
And there's the third goal. That's it, third goal for Germany. Yet, but Germany scored. You saw the signal. It was a slightly lower corner than they sometimes take. The previous goal went to the top corner. This one, they aimed it down to the bottom. Rafael was able to, to make the interception and he's one possession back, but it's loose. Charles it. Oh, oh, that is a big tackle, a big foul from Andre Kopp, the German goalkeeper, really clattered into the penalty shot for Switzerland because of the nature of that foul. Here we go. A wonderful save, and again the crossbar the second time. Switzerland have hit that crossbar in the that second Swiss half. Team. Oh, again, what a wonderful save that was, and so far unfortunate. And now that might just be it. Will they have one last final heroic go? Here we go, shooting chance, and yes. they do find the bottom corner. Possession is almost as good as a goal here for Germany, yeah. but they'll go on better and finish it off with a wonderful goal. It's almost tears. Raphael Kopp, they've been the reserve team last year, their first world championship, their retirement season, and they are going to be the world champions.